Right, <clears throat> this is an inspection of the drain. Uh, the first thing, we've got to have the right tools for the job. This, for example, is the Lovelock lid lifter for lifting the drain cover. Uh, it says the Lovelock lid lifter. Even women can use it. Um, so, for example, it says your handy pandies go at this end. And then there's simple instructions, like this way up. And it's instructions there for women, so women can use it. Uh, so it says, for example, uh, one screw bolt, 10 turns into the middle of drain lid. Um, place this lever under the bolt handles as shown. Lift gently and swing lid to side so it sits on the floor. Take care not to drop lid into the big hole. Only do all this when a man is within shouting distance. Uh, so that's uh, just so that they know. So now we'll see what we get on the CCTV. So lots of drain rods and a underwater camera with its monitor, which we switch on here. And it's got an LED on it, nice and bright, to look down the drain. And we can see the picture here, just like that. That's where it's going. So now we're going to Gonna try and look down the drain. It's the drain, and there's the drain rods. So it's a process of putting lots and lots of drain rods onto the camera, and hopefully we can get it round the corner and into the drain. Now got three rods. This is a fiddly bit to go around the corner. Right. Don't know if you can hear me, but now we're gonna and go down the drain. Here we go, along the drain. Yep, we can see along it. So here we go. So what we're doing as we go along the drain, we're adding drain rods. We know that the total run right way through the drain is about seven meters. That, that means seven drain rods going into the drain. seven meters to the very end of the, the drain which is near the utility room sink and probably a meter or two before that there'll be the place where the soap tends to catch which is where there's a t-junction coming from the kitchen drain which runs alongside the kitchen just outside Must be close, so let's have a look where we are. Yeah, I reckon that's the end of the drain there where it goes up. So that's where it goes up into the into the um, kitchen, and we're now coming back. And what we should be able to do find is uh, Right, could you run all the taps, June? Then I might be able to see where... Oh, that's some camera cable. You want to run the taps? Yeah, run all the taps. The utility room and... Right, I've just put in a bit of 
spare cable back. Trying to find out where Somewhere or other, water should, yeah, right, now we can see the water coming, so that tells us where the bottom is, and we should see where the water comes out. Uh, actually, this is much better. Um, mm -hmm. If you can turn off the utility rooms first, we can confirm where the water comes from the kitchen. That's probably coming from the utility room, I'm guessing, but I can't be absolutely sure. So what we turned off at the moment, just the utility room? Yes. Good. And you've got the kitchen running? Yes. Um, so, if we go forward, we should see where the water comes out. There's quite a lot of soap there by the look of it. Yeah, there's a, look at this though, it's very, very clear. Oh. oh yeah, that's much clearer. Now that's where the yeah. water comes from the kitchen. Right. So if I go forward, we're knocking the yeah. soap. Yeah. That's as fast as, you're running both taps. Run oh. both. In fact, if you run all the taps now, including the utility room. So you get a decent flush of water if my shift that soap. So hot and cold taps, uh, utility room and the kitchen. That's hot and cold on both. Yeah, a bit of soap there. So that must be... Looks like the water level is... We're now dropping below. Right. Right, turn it off again. And turn, turn off the just the kitchen ones and leave the utility room. See so if we can see where the water's coming from the utility room. Right. I think it's just a matter of luck of where the where the camera goes under the water there. Mm -hmm. So that's just the utility room, is it? Yes. Yeah, but I must be that the camera is under the water. So if we turn all the water off now, mm -hmm. utility room as well. We're clearly under the water. Something else. That's a bit too 
various. Oh, oh, wow. Mm. Oh, I don't know what that is. No. That looks. It's not. It really could be. Roots. It could be rubbish that's yeah, fallen the... down the drain. Yeah. But that looks like a load of soap behind it. Could be. Um, right. Run the kitchen one, and I'll also try the hose outside. Right, run the kitchen both taps, and I'll also run the um, hose outside. Oh, and we could run the... No, underwater. They're not completely there, is it? Um, try running the utility room as well, so I've got everything going. Right, I think we can afford to turn all the taps off now and we'll see better than how it's going. turned off the outside hose and the all the taps including the outside hose the utility room and the kitchen so water's now stopped draining and what's that a bit further along the drain that looks like a container of some kind doesn't it what's that There's a few odds and ends there. Yeah. It's complete rubbish, isn't it? Yeah. So, Look, same thing we saw earlier. Well, we probably from a different yeah. angle. Yeah. It's, it's lots of junk, basically, yeah. that has gone down, yeah. probably dropped in the drain from outside and got yeah. stuck on that bend. Yeah. So whether we can get past it, see if you can... Going past it at all? Not yet. No, not yet. Oh, he's there. Up against it now. Mm. I'll just run the utility room tap on the off chance that. It's still exactly the same. Oh, perhaps the camera's shifted now. Ah, that's it, so the camera's shifted, so we can't, it's probably looking sideways. That's a good time to stop, okay? I'll, um, that's it. <coughs> and are you able to use the lid lifter as well, aren't you, dear? The, no. the lid no. lifter, yes. No. No. Right, what's nice hiding?